Let me say that much. I'm not a prophetess, but once in a while, God will give me a prophecy or a word. This morning, I was in bed because I'm getting ready for my hip surgery in a few days, but I was praying as I did yesterday morning, and I was identifying with Jesus as the good shepherd. I mean, just how he cares for us, just like a good shepherd would care for a lost little sheep. And I was just crying and, you know, just, Lord, you're so good to us. And and uh, all of a sudden I got the word right, right, right. So I said, I don't want to write. I don't want to get up. I'm, I hurt so bad. Just let me be comfortable, please. And then he kept, you know, after me, he said, no, get up and write. So I did. And I ended up with five huge pages on the three days and nights of gross darkness. And I'm going to read them to you just exactly the way the Holy Spirit gave them to me. And then I put this word out on some of the other channels. And I said, I hope you don't mind, but I just want to, you, to alert you to this in case you want to pass the message on and get people um, to listen to it. I do not care about my channel. I have very few subscribers. I thank God for each one, but you know, I'm not here to build an uh, empire. I'm just here to do the will of the Lord. That's it. So let, Father, I'm all um, so excited and uh, overwhelmed with this message. And Lord, I was, this was birthed through much pain and much tears and you brought it forth. So as I read it to the people, please, Holy Spirit, come through loud and clear because this is an important word. I praise and thank you that you used anyone, that you spoke to anyone, let alone me, Lord, to bring forth this message. Bless it in Jesus' name. Okay, so here we go. I am, this is what the Lord God says, I am the good shepherd this era of time as mankind knows time is coming to its end as of a few days from now everything is coming to its sudden change the time of serious transition is soon to come upon the entire earth the scientists will call it earth or climate change but i the lord god almighty call it my holy will and the fulfillment of my holy and most profound decrees, which have been established from time immemorial. I am the great I am. My plan shall stand. Nothing can be done by the feeble mortal hand of man to alter, hinder, or stop what I have prepared for mankind. Truly, this era of mankind's journey on earth is quickly coming to a close as I change and rearrange all things. This earth will soon enter a time of severe global darkness. People will understand as I, the almighty God, draw the curtain of black up on the planet. Those people of mine who have heard of this word will understand. I will grab the sudden attention of mankind as all the technology comes to a sudden incapacitating, can't say that word, incapacitating ability to function. All will be silent and mankind will be thrown into sudden disarray. They will panic as confusion sets in. Many people will lose rational thinking as the curtain of gross darkness covers the earth. I, the Lord God, must do this to literally grab the attention of all the citizens of earth. My people, those who know Jesus Christ as their Lord and Savior, will be shaken far less than the sinner. They will... They will be stabilized by my Holy Spirit as the unction of my Holy Presence falls upon them. My Holy Spirit will calm their minds as they, 
as they falter for a while, gathering their wits about them. So you, my beloved children, so see, pardon, so see, my beloved children, there are millions of Christians who are saved by my grace that have never heard of the days of darkness. That's why I'm calling up on you to tell them what is just around the bend. You may approach it with scientific terms for it will, for I will indeed use the natural means. I will use natural means to create this phenomenon. My planet, which many call planet X or Nibiru or Nebiru, is stealing its way to eventually cover your sun. This planet has been observed in various places on Earth at times with the naked eye. When the when this planet covers your sun, when this occurs, I will, in my great mercy, hold and totally control the Earth's temperature at 55 degrees so that no man or animal will freeze. I'm interjecting because if a planet would cover the sun, normally speaking, we would be thrown into an ice age. But God himself is going to control the temperature in his mercy upon earth. The Holy Spirit goes on to say, however, cold will be felt. So gather blankets for warmth, food and water, medical needs if necessary must be at the ready. Do not discount this admonition for you will need food and water unless you choose to fast. Candles must be white and unscented. Do not question me over this. Oil lights may be used. Use refined oil as much as possible. Listen well, my beloved ones. I am your Holy Father in heaven. You have no earthly Holy Father. The Pope of Rome is not holy. For I alone am holy. These days of gross darkness are my great act of mercy to get the full attention of mankind. It is at that time that many of the world's false gods will fall. Those who worship any false god will have the blinders removed, and they will be able to choose me as Lord God and Savior if they so desire. The ultimate choice will still be theirs as I force no one to surrender to me. Listen further, my beloved ones. Immediately before this darkness falls, the earth will quake. The earth will quake as it groans for the manifestation of the sons of God. In many places, there will be actual earthquakes occurring. The darkness descends. The, as a dark, the darkness descends, and there will be majestic displays in the cosmos. I, the Lord God Almighty, the Lord Jesus Christ, God in the flesh, will rearrange the skies for mankind to see the glorious colors and the deep blood red as the colors wander around the earth. They will see this phenomenon that has never been seen before. I have reserved it for this time. Planet X will bring with it a great will bring with it great earth changes as the atmosphere will be charged with electricity. This will not hurt or kill mankind, but this is something they can see as the discharge will be intense. When these changes begin to occur in the heavens, you are to notify your loved ones immediately. They are to drop whatever they're doing and immediately come to their home. It is, now listen, important. 
it is best if family members can be together in the home of one of the believers in Yeshua, Jesus Christ. This is why I desire that you tell them beforehand what's coming to the earth so they are willing to cooperate with you when the time arrives. Otherwise, they will call you crazy and not come into the home interjecting. In other words, when the skies, we see like the, the aurora borealis or the bright red stripes in the sky, and we see the, the, the lightning out of season, and we see all this cosmic display, and we call our loved one and we say, hey, so this is the time, come, it's going to turn dark in a day or two or whatever.